Hey everybody, I'm here today to talk to you about four tips for driving a manual car. Now, these tips are really useful whether you are new to driving manual or you have been driving a manual car for a long, long time. So let's get right to the tips. The first tip is to rev match when downshifting. Now, rev matching will definitely reduce the amount of wear and tear on the clutch and it will definitely make your downshifts a lot smoother. Now, rev matching is basically touching the gas pedal to increase the RPMs when you are downshifting. So you basically just give the throttle a little blip to spike the RPMs when you are downshifting. The second tip is don't use heel toe on main roads. Now heel toe is very useful in track situations because it allows you to rev match downshift while you are still touching the brake pedal. Um, but on main roads it can actually be quite dangerous. So with that being said, I would definitely say avoid using heel toe, the heel toe technique on main roads and save it for the track situations because the heel toe technique is really, really cool and also really useful. But if you use it on a main road, it can put you in a dangerous situation. So save it for track situations. The third tip is don't ride the clutch. Now basically the only times in which the clutch pedal is not receiving any wear and tear is when the clutch pedal is fully pressed down or fully released. So only in those two positions. Whenever the clutch pedal is somewhere in the middle of those two positions, there will be some wear and tear on the clutch. Now, it is absolutely inevitable that you will have to put the clutch in between those fully down and fully up positions. But basically, when I say don't ride the clutch, I mean just try and keep the, uh, um, the amount of time that the clutch is in the middle of those positions to an absolute minimum. And you know, don't leave your foot resting on the clutch pedal when you are driving because it can also be considered as riding the clutch and it can also produce some additional unnecessary wear and tear on the clutch. And the fourth tip is use your brakes instead of downshifting when you are slowing the car down if you want the most cost effective way of slowing the car down. So yes, when you slow the car down, you can either brake or downshift. And don't get me wrong, downshifting feels cool and also looks cool and is very useful. But the fact of the matter is that both braking and downshifting will slow the car down. And replacing your brakes is much easier, faster, and therefore cheaper than replacing your clutch. So with that being said, if you are looking for the most cost-effective way to slow your car down, then you should definitely brake instead of downshift. And that's basically it. Those are my four tips for driving a manual car. They are useful tips for people that are just learning to drive a manual car and they can also be useful for people that have been driving a manual car for a long, long time. So definitely take them into consideration and keep them in mind when you are driving a manual car. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.